Playground surfacing is specifically intended to prevent injuries when a child impacts the surface following a fall. One needs to know the GMAX and HIC values to meet the required safety standards. The only way to measure these values is to test with the device that meets ASTM and ISO standards. Introducing the Triax Touch. The testing for impact attenuation is the result of more than 60 years of military and automotive research and standardization. The Triax Touch meets the requirements of ASTM F1292, F3313, and F355. It also meets the requirements of international standards EN 1177 and ISO 24667. The Triax Touch system is portable and comes neatly packed in a wheeled hard side transport case. The Triax Touch comes with the Triax Touch handheld controller, the Triax Touch head form, or as it is known in ASTM F355, the E missile, an MEP mat for reference drops. A manual drop handle for rapid assessment. A charger. A tripod with leg extensions for drops up to 12 feet, or a little over 3.5 meters. A surveyor's measuring rod to accurately and easily set drop heights. And the Triax Testing System's exclusive reporting software. Once the testing location and drop height has been established based on the required standards, setting the tripod up is quick and easy. Simply snap together the tripod legs and stand up the tripod with care. It is highly recommended to stand the tripod up with two people to prevent tip-overs, damage to the tripod, and of course to prevent injury to the inspectors. Remember to raise the tripod steel block within the tripod to prevent it swinging into an operator. Power on the head form and handheld controller by pressing the power buttons on each. Once both are turned on, they will connect via Bluetooth. The handheld controller will display Start. Pressing this will begin the testing. Connect the head form to the tripod steel block. To adjust the height, release the cable clamp on the tripod leg. Pull the steel cable to raise the head form. Lower the head form by allowing the cable to slowly feed through the cable block. Make sure to securely lock the cable clamp once the correct height is set. You are now ready to perform the test. Once everyone is clear of the path of the falling head form, press Release to drop the head form from the tripod. Data is immediately generated and transferred to the handheld controller via Bluetooth. For more information on navigating menus, please refer to the user manual. To upload testing data of the drops to your PC and generate reports, remove the memory card from the side of the handheld unit and insert it into the adapter. The Triax reporting software will need to be installed on a Windows-based PC. Once the software is loaded, the drop test data can be transferred from the memory card to the PC. To upload drops, make sure the memory card and adapter are securely inserted into your computer's memory card slot. Open the Triax report software. Select Memory Card at the top left and press Select Drops for Upload. This will open a new window to select your drops. Select or confirm the memory card path is to the destination where the drops are stored. Select the drops you would like to transfer by checking the box next to each number. Once the drops are selected, press Upload. Confirm all of the drops are in the application window. To ensure data integrity, all of the values displayed are fixed and cannot be changed. To print the report, select Report at the top of the window, then select Print Full Report. Another window will open asking for which drops you would like the graphs printed. If you do not want graphs on this report, do not select any and proceed by pressing Print. The report will print to the default printer under the Options tab. You will now be able to review and print the report. For more information on navigating the software, please see the user manual. To find out further details or to request information on pricing and availability, please visit triaxtouch.com or send an email to triaxtouch at alpha-automation.com.